many secretaries do we have? You? No, I'm your, I'm your secretary. Oh, don't fall. You're going to get your shoes dirty. That was stupid. As you soon as I did it, I was like, that's a bad idea. Got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> bad idea. You ever get beat up on the school playground? No, I fell off playing chicken one. A kid pushed me off of there and I fell flat down on my face and got a mouthful of blood. I saw the face of the kid who I still think pushed me. His name is David Fox. Don't get comfortable, David. I'm still coming for you. Don't you go dying on me. Tyler, you want to do a devotional? Yes. Oh, this is a bad idea. I got a really bad feeling about this. Been breaking ankles in two sports for years. Question. Whoa. Tell me what you think about me. No, I'm just kidding. Do you ever remind yourself of your past failures? Yeah, absolutely. You're in luck. What? Because that's what we're talking about today. Church community, right where you are. Hey, so uh, getting past your past may be one of the biggest obstacles that you face. Like the past, like you struggling to get over that kid shoving you off the top of that yeah. play set. Sometimes when we seem like we're making progress, it's like the how you age challenge or it's like 10 years, a photo of you 10 years later. Yep. Here we go, Niels. And Tyler's. Wow. But we look pretty much the same. Our past, it has this sneaky way of reminding us of our failures. And you might even believe that forgiveness is for other people and not you. Because you've done, oh, mine, mine's too much. I've had so too many much. mistakes. Well, everybody else has mistakes, but my mistakes are real mistakes. Yeah. You may think that, that it's too late. It's it, not. It's not. It's guilt and shame that actually keeps us stuck. Yeah. You make the mistake once, but then you feel guilty for it every time you think yeah, about it. Yeah. When you're stuck in quicksand, you ain't moving forward. Have you ever been stuck in quicksand? I uh, kind of. I'd gotten taken to this pirate ship. Anybody want to feel that? Came back and found my true love. Knowledge. I was facing them, I got stuck in this quicksand. Yeah. You'd like to think that, wouldn't you? That's how I became the Dread Pirate Roberts. Inconceivable. Have you ever asked God to forgive you over and over and over for the same things? Yes. I do too. Now those thoughts, remember we're talking about the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. Those thoughts are from the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. Yep. Mm -hmm. Psalm 103, 12, next verse says, he has removed our sins as far from us as the east is from the west. I always thought that that said something else. I always thought it was, he removes your sin as far as the east is from the west. Right. I always thought this verse said he removes it as far as, but it says he has removed our sins as far from us, from us. as the east is from the west. It's not just a distance that he's Done, he's getting it away from you. Now, this is a picture of how much God loves us, and yeah. we need to forgive ourselves. And, and if God is going to forgive you, then you should forgive yourself. Yeah, and if you don't think asking his forgiveness once is powerful enough, you're underestimating God. If God isn't holding it against us, neither should we, Neil. Yeah. Neither should we. Neither should you. We should. You should. Neither should they. That's, I, somebody's going to hear us. What? Every time. Every time I get too Every loud, and Neil starts walking like, Tyler. I can't help myself! We asked that question at the beginning. Are you constantly reminding yourself of your past failures? Yep. And if you are, we got to forgive ourselves. So got to. We want to pray and, and ask God for some help in this because you might need some help and we want to pray for you as well. God, we ask you to forgive us of the sin in our lives. We know how much you love us and you forgive us every time. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Whoa! What if that was full of water? Oh, no, I didn't think that through. You never thought that through. I didn't think it through, bro. Gosh. I think I pulled a hammy. This is Church in Real Time. Glad you're here with us. NLC Live, baby. I just stepped in so much mud. Oh my God. I don't think it means what you think it means.